The organ of vision, the eye, undoubtedly remains vital part of the human body. But ignorance of eye care and its prevention oftentimes resulted in blindness and vision impairment. The initiative of Vision 2020, the Right to Sight, a joint undertaking of the World Health Organization, an international agency for the prevention of blindness, set aside every second Thursday of October to mark the World Sight Day. The essence is geared towards highlighting the importance of good vision for all people and the limiting effect that uncorrected vision impairment can have on lives and society at large. Observing the day in Abuja, the Nigerian Optometric Association FCT chapter, in collaboration with NTA and Lions Club, put together this sensitization with the theme for the year 2015, I Care for All. We are propagating trying to create awareness so that people will ensure that they go to hospitals, have their eye examined. The government should also support the Nigerian Automatic Association in terms of providing equipment. It is important that we also educate our staff that they know the common causes of blindness and how to prevent them. Guest speaker in separate submissions educate participants on the challenges and way forward towards actualizing good quality eye care services in Nigeria, importance of vision and driving, as well as the need for collaboration by stakeholders and individuals. Eye care issues should be taken as a public health challenge and to this effect government should find a way to um, locate eye care centers in the primary health care centers. Beneficiaries applauded the concept and described it as the right peg in the right hole. I'm sure all of us have uh, one or two problems and they've just taken care of mine, can see the glasses. Today the eye test you know, has been brought even to my doorstep, so I'm very happy. INT has done very, very well. I feel it very nice to help me to get a eyeglass for reading. The event was climbers with donation of free eyeglass and checkup where critical cases were referred. In Abuja, Aisha Uba Ali, NTE News.